Hello and once again welcome to the Myth World Cup 2012 uh, brought to you by the new mutator bringing you these uh, shoutcasted games so you can see just what's going on here uh, now Myth, Myth 2 Soul Blighter is a pretty old game so and you know my machine is not that wonderful so <laughs> this is not going to be in HD quality and it's not going to look very impressive when compared with any of the newer games but hopefully that's not why you're watching and you're watching for the uh, the wonderful gameplay aspects the the uh, just the intricacy of the strategies involved and uh, and also because uh, this is a uh, an annual tournament in in which uh, kind of miss best players uh, are able to uh, demonstrate their skills and uh, compete for the championship. So once again, this is uh, the qualifying round uh, for the first week. Game number four between Name Changers and Deer. Name Changers once again led by Adrenaline, Sam, and Zach. Uh, I believe that's is it Autumn or August? I don't even I don't even really know. I'm sorry, Mr. Rousey. Uh, and uh, Brutalitops uh, or Shyster are going to be playing for the name changers here in the uh, southwest corner, the black team. And the green team, the, this uh, hunter green color here, is going to be captained by Vantobia. It's a uh, deer once again. Uh, no more Bronson. Instead, we have Anculator, who actually plays for Grimm's My Team. Uh, he's going to be substituting and you can actually substitute even if you are on a team in this tournament Scratch and Sasper uh, Scratch is substituting as well alright so uh, so that's Deer's <laughs> this is what Deer is able to field uh, it's going to be 5 on 4 once again uh, Scratch and Anculator not actually on Deer, but Vantobia and Sasper showing up and uh, trying to uh, trying to make the the most out of a kind of a bad situation for their team. And uh, so I guess this is the uh, this is the correct mesh for the qualifying rounds. Remember the. Uh, the age versus sentinel Game matchup on. played a uh, a different mesh and adrenaline opts for three whites he's going to try to sink those this is flag rally uh two flag no three whites you. for deer as well they're going to try to sink one you know uh in this deep water here maybe one in here maybe another one maybe two on one side and uh, but there's just going to be so many whites if they can if they can uh, successfully sink them into this water there there it's going to be really crowded in there so we'll see what happens once again both teams are going to be uh trying to tag all flags it is flag rally and a, uh, a sizable force heading east they're going to cut through this hole in the wall and just kind of Flag make this capture. little maneuver here where they tag the flag but it looks like uh, they're going to be met by a deer force headed by Anculator and Anculator did really well on this map for Grimm's my team but I'm not sure if he's going to be able to duplicate that performance uh, w with the support of deer, uh, there's just not very many people able to come to his aid, and he's just going to have to kind of fend for himself down here. Flag captured. Flag captured. So deer convincingly taking the center flag, but we'll see if they're able to hold on to it or if they give it up to the name changers. And it was about this time, uh, last game, when Anculator, or I'm sorry, la during the <laughs> during the last match on this on this map, 
Ankulator. Ankulator's ex-girlfriend called him, and he had to uh, he had to take that phone call before coming back and owning with his artillery. Looks like uh, Deer just lost their tro. Adrenaline keeps his alive, but it's it's not a whole lot of health on that. But uh, definitely coming out on top for the name changers. And wow, looks like. Uh, I'm sorry, that's Yeah, it looks like uh looks like Shyster kind of took out those uh those malls there. I thought those were were uh were his I got confused. Anyway, don't listen to me. Keep watching what's going on. We're gonna we're gonna see that Enculator and his opponent, uh Sam, are just kinda they're going to be kind of uh, going toe-to-toe -to -toe in just a minute. But uh, Vantobia just going to get cleaned up here. It's 80% to 68%. And that's, uh, that's kind of, that's kind of the, the, the mark of a lesser player, one that just kind of throws his units away. You know, not... not willing or able to retreat when he should. Really wants to get this tro, but I'm just not sure if it's going to happen. Actually, it does happen. Adrenaline, adrenaline allows his tro to be destroyed, but it was so low on health that it almost didn't even matter. And actually, name changers are only up by 8%. Vantobia's Maul... I don't know why Vantobia decided to uh, work on that mall. He almost died there. Vantobia's mall not able to catch up with Adrenaline Solus and Name Changers do come out on top. They still are up 8%. Ankulator trying to make something happen only manages to freeze a couple units. Not really anything special there. Kind of a waste. And it sounded like another Flag white went off capture. somewhere. I don't think Victory it did very imminent. much. And uh, really, uh, Vantobia just kind of chased Adrenaline's force, or the Name Changer's force, all the way across the map, but didn't manage to tag any flags. Once again, Deer, I'm just not sure if they're going to be able to uh, hold on to this game. They are close in percentages, but I'm, I fear that they're not playing the, the right game type. They're playing BC and not Flag Rally. Zach trying to, uh, trying to delay their tagging of Flag 1 and really doing an a excellent job. Flag captured. As uh, Scratch just kind of suicide some units out of desperation just really wanted to get that flag and I didn't really quite see what happened here with Enculator and Mr. Rousey but it looks like looks like they're both kind of trying in a race to the deer home flag that was interesting. Looks like uh, looks like Vantobia able to get a oh sacrifices one mortar dwarf but keeps the other one, so that's good. And Enculator really lucky to be alive. This. His uh, warlock Segulinak <laughs> in the uh, in the red there, Mr. Rousey as well. Uh, his warlock's name is Brayamus. Wow! And Enculator loses both his artillery. Really, an unfortunate uh, occurrence when that happens. That's that did happen in the previous match, and that's really. Um, it's really not something that 
that you should see uh, competent players do. Remaining. But it does happen from time to time. And it, and it is difficult to play myth. I'm not sure if... Uh, I'm not sure if anyone who's watching has uh, attempted to play a multiplayer game quite like this. Uh, it is fairly more difficult to micromanage in Myth than it is in most other games because of the uh, because of the 3D camera. And who knows what other factors uh, affecting that. It looks like uh, it's just going to be a slow death here for Team Deer. They just lost all their art artillery and they're being set upon by Sam and uh, Mr. Rousey also closing in. They're just going to be whittled away and of course they're not going to engage uh, with everything. They're going to send, they're going to keep some of their units on the flag just in case somebody decides to come in there and their melee just isn't going to be enough, especially with this Mercridia. Uh, they that are just going to tear through those malls, uh, making the malls flinch when they get hit, so that they don't even return return any blows. So, not looking good for Deer. I think it's just a matter of seconds here before uh, name changers also take game number four. So it was it was looking it was looking. Uh, like Deer was putting up a pretty good fight, but uh, you know if they they flag they were trying capture. to uh, to play body count instead of uh, flag rally, and as a result, uh, you know through a couple of misclicks or miscalculations, um, you know losing all that artillery didn't help either. Uh, just really an unfortunate loss for Deer. They were probably really looking to pull out a win so that they didn't uh, it, it, it would have been uh, something of an upset but it, it would have been uh, good for their self esteem I'm sure uh, looks like every single player on name changers did really well and that's probably because of the last couple minutes of the game and uh, really Enculator uh, not able to live up to his performance of the previous match for Grimm's team, Grimm's my team, I should say, um, kind of letting the deer team down, but when your team doesn't show up, who's letting your team down? That's all I have to say about that. So, uh, once again, it's not going to matter too much. This is still the qualifying round. There's plenty of games left in deer's future, as we shall see, and on to game five.